In this video, we're going to have a quick look at opening and saving Excel workbooks. It's very similar to... It's very similar to Microsoft Office Word 2007. And again, do remember that in this video I'm using 2010 rather than 2007. If we go to the File menu, or the Office button, as it would be, all we have to do to open an Excel file is click on Open, and that will navigate us to our documents. I'm going to find my one in here. Need Unit 2. And that's a workbook opened. A workbook, remember, contains a number of different worksheets. It could be one, it could be 50. Depends on how many you create. Remember that Excel will always open by default with a blank workbook with three worksheets. If we make changes to these worksheets and then we want to save those changes, all we have to do is say File or Office button and then Save Remember, save will just overwrite the original file, so you won't have the old version, you'll only have the new version with the same file name. If we want to change the file name, or save it as a different, or with a different name, if we select Save As, that will open the Save As dialog box, and here we can amend the file name. It's automatically highlighted in blue, so anything that we type in will overwrite the original file. Once you've typed in your file name, all you have to do is click on Save, and it will save the document. And we can see that it's been saved because the file name at the very top of the program window has been changed.